Hello guys, it's Cut here and welcome back to Star Stable. I'm now unsure what to do because the Midsummer Festival is finally here. But I also said that we should continue with the quest up on it, Silver Glade Equestrian Center. So I don't know what to do. I really want to start the Midsummer Festival because that festival will not be here for a long time. But this particular quest up on Silver Glade Equestrian Center will be here forever. <laughs> so yeah, I think we will go down to the Midsummer Festival and start there. If we have more time, I think we should head up to Silver Glade Vineyard again. But we also have a circus with Idris that we started in the previous episode. So, ah, we have so much to do now and I'm really enjoying it. But we take the Midsummer Festival. It's lo it looks so nice on the picture, so yeah, we have to. <laughs> Let's see, Midsummer Festival, here we come. Oh, I'm really looking forward to start it looks amazing on all these pictures. I think we take a shortcut over the old GED building site. Yeah, and here we can buy all these things for the Yeah, the bridge. Totally forgot about that. We need to continue on that too. <gasps> oh, we have so much to do. Ooh, look at this place. And we coming from the wrong side, but that doesn't do anything. Wow, how adorable. Oh gosh, I love this place already. We picnic uh, what, places, lights, picnic baskets. What's this little thing? Little circus? <laughs> no, it's say something. Zero of seven flowers. And what do you sell exactly? Oh gosh, how adorable! Oh my gosh, we need to buy it! But it's so expensive! <laughs> wow, look at all these clothes! They are so beautiful! Oh, there's so much to buy for a horse in our character. <gasps> and... Oh, we can have it on our horse! Oh gosh we need all this and my voice is too light <laughs> oh my gosh okay okay calm down Susie we need to speak to this person here oh of course there's more people here <laughs> because of we visit the shop everyone disappeared of course hello ranger Marisol ranger Marisol can you tell me what this amazing play is or if there any we can help with let me know Midsummer is when we celebrate the long days of summer with family and friends. The festival is beloved throughout Northern Europe, but now where is it more popular than here in Jorvik? This year's Midsummer celebration is being organized by the Jorvik Rangers, and it's said to be Jorvik's biggest yet. We are almost set up, but there are a few more tasks left. Do you think you and your horse could help out? Yes, please, I really want to. We want to help, of course. That's the spirit. There are three stations where my colleagues can use your assistance. Well, that was a difficult name. Stanislav. Stanislav is in charge of raising the Midsummer Pole. Or fire safety expert Ashley. Ashley is in charge of the bonfire. Finally, I put Dylan in charge of setting up the banquet tables. With your help, the party will begin in no time. Ah, oh, okay. Ooh, let's help them out. Everyone, I'm here to help. <laughs> oh, great. You must be the volunteer Mary so promised me. I'm in charge of the midsummer banquet. There's gonna be Salomon from South Hoof. Herring from Cap West, potatoes from Steve's, and fresh berries from Mistfall. I can't wait to stuff my face. You can wait to stuff your face. <laughs> I can't wait to stuff my face. Not that I will touch anything until the guests are finished. <laughs> In any case, before we can set out the food, someone needs to set up the tables and chairs. You will help with that, won't you? Of course I will. 
Thomas Morland was kind enough to offer up some folding chairs and tables from his stable. He should have set them out, so all you need to do is ride down with your horse and pick them up. All right, I will. Oh, I think we need to place them here. <laughs> should we check all the different quests at the same time? If we're gonna collect some more, I think. Yeah, we do that. Hello, Stainslav. I'm not sure how I should pronounce your name. <laughs> You can celebrate Midsummer without Midsummer Paul. It needs to be tall enough to be seen from far away, but also wide and strong enough to last through weeks of partiers dancing round and round. It so happens there's a perfect pole just down the way by Old Jasper's farmhouse. I checked with the owner and he says we were more than welcome to take it. It's too heavy for me to carry, but I see you have a good strong horse. Maybe the two of you could fetch the pole up here. Sure. I will. Oh, I think Whoa, that was a big pole that was going up there. All right. Okay, you must be the charge in charge of the bonfire. Every midsummer festival needs a bonfire to keep the party going into the night. So we should just gather up some locks. Dust them with light lighter fluid and get our flame on right sure no no okay wrong <laughs> okay fire is not something we ranger take lightly one spark is all it takes to turn a forest into cinders that's why this year we're doing things my way the safe way of course of course you in charge i already picked out the site for the bonfire 18 meters from any trees or buildings. Now we need some kindling to serve as the foundation for the fire. Old Jasper offered up some spare lumber that he's been storing by the farmhouse over yonder. Over yonder, okay. That should do nicely. Could you and Phantom Lace help bring it up here? Sure. You will use proper lifting technique getting those logs onto your horse. Of course, do not lift with your back, but with your strong arms. Oh, where were we? <laughs> uh, logs on your horse, right? Yeah, of course. Of course you will. We are sister in safety. <laughs> all right. Let's get all these things. That was a lot. Okay, tables and chairs. Poles needed and base logs needed. Yeah, we, we go to Jasper afterwards, because two of the things was there. What we first need is chairs and tables. Alright, I think we need to go in here. Hello, Justin, have you seen any chairs and tables? Oh, no? Okay, we will go to the next part of your stable then. Okay, here then. Oh, there we have it. Thank you. Oh, there's more. Can we bring all of it at the time? Yeah, we can for sure. <laughs> all right, we have the shears and tables. Oh, here they are, Dylan. Nice work with the tables and shears. Remind me to thank Thomas later. He's been so helpful with the festivities this year. Said something about making sure the girls who came to his riding camp see Jorvik as its best. Speaking of Jorvik's best, let's get that banquet set up. Oh, we get down. We got down from. Ooh, okay. Wow, how nice. That was fast though. <laughs> okay, we are very good at building things, I think. Okay, let's get the other things then. Oh, I see something behind here. That must be for the bonfire. Yep. Can we go? Yep. Ashley, here they are. Perfect. Our bonfire is off to a great start. And as a bonus, we took care of a fire hazard at Jesper's farmhouse. A double win for safety. Can we get down again? <laughs> Just build up the bonfire. small but I think it will be nice okay now we need this long long pole or is it behind here oh oh okay that was a long one why not <laughs> that 
Wow, you cannot ride a long way with this one without making some damage to someone. <laughs> if you hit someone. I don't know. Okay. Interesting. Okay. Here is the long pole. Oh, we cannot go through that, of course. All right. Here we go. Or well, here is the pole. Perfect. Now we just need to decorate it. All right. Let's start the next round with helping these people out. Ooh, leaves for the pole. Flowers for color. You wrap the midsummer pole in fresh green leaves to celebrate the season. There are plenty of branches in the woods between here and Moreland Stables. We will need a lot of leaves, so take your horse and gather as many as the two of you can carry. Alright. Next one, please. Flowers of color. A proper midsummer pole is decorated with wildflowers to showcase the beauty of summer. I don't think Thomas Moreland will mind if you pick some flowers from the woods nearby. Why don't you and your horse go and pick a good mix of blooms? Once you have wrapped leaves around the pole, you can use those flowers to decorate it. Ooh, fancy, gladly. But we also take the quests from the other people here. We need more fuel to make sure this fire blazes long into the night and I know just where to find it. There's a GED construction site nearby with plenty of good lumber. You and Phantom Blaze are going to take it. <gasps> Bad guys. Stealing? No way. The Yorvik Rangers are government servants. I'm simply commandeering that lumber for the public good. Trust me, it will be fine. Gladly, GED. We want them far, far away from this place. A movable feast. A movable feast. A good party is a loud party. <laughs> we are accepting a big turnout at this year's party. It's going to be tough to hear the music over everyone laughing and having fun. A good party is a loud party, am I right? I want people to feel the oomph, oomph, oomph. <laughs> Okay, that was a bit fun. The oomph, oomph. <laughs> in their bones. Okay. Fortunately, James also offered to let us borrow speakers from the Fort Pinta Disco for use at the Midsummer stage. Think you could pick those up as well? Sure. But I'm not so sure if James gonna lend you these for free. That's not his personality. Ooh. Some big speakers though. A movable feast. James at Fort Pinta is generously sponsoring the food for the banquet. He just sent me a text saying that everything is ready for pickup, so maybe you could ride down to Fort Pinta and pick it up. It should be waiting for you next to the disco. Are you sure about this? Doesn't sound like the James we know. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, we take the flowers first. That was not easy. Oh, maybe we need to go up here. Here we have a lot of things. Okay, now we have 12, 12 leaves. Now we need the flowers. 12, 12 flowers as well, okay. All right, now we have everything or the flowers and the leaves. So let's go back to the festival site and leave it there. And eventually decorate this pole with these beautiful flowers. All right, let's put it here. And we will get back to him after we have found or collected the other things. All right, here we are. And I'm not sure about this, that James just lend us these things for free. I do not believe it, actually. Okay, can we get this at the same time? Yes, we can. Awesome. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Uh, we need one more. Where is the other things? Oh, here we have it. Oh, I'm so sure that James will. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> will send a big bill after the Midsummer Festival. But wow, look at this tower of boxes. <laughs> oh gosh. Poor horse, but. He seems to have a, no problem with carrying it. 
Can we? <laughs> this is not normal. Ah, too funny. Way too funny. All right, here we are with the speakers and food or some sort or drinks. I do not, I do not remember. Food or drinks of some sort. Yeah. Okay. Now we need to take some stuff from the GED site. Gladly. <laughs> okay. Let. Oh, sorry, horsey. I didn't thought it was so steep there. Yeah, we'll take this road instead. Okay. Let's get some lumber or something. Yeah. Or no locks. What am I saying? <laughs> Okie doke. Eight of eight. Let's get back to Midsummer Festival and get everything out. Ooh. <laughs> Okay, we're oh, of course, over here. No, oh, of course, on the table. Emergency. <laughs> okay, let's start with ah, Stanislav over here. Well, um, as of fact. The pool is looking great. Now it's time to decorate. Ooh. How big? Decoration time! Wonderful, this will be the most impressive midsummer poll yet. <gasps> oh, it's so beautiful and so much colors on it. It's very beautiful. The midsummer poll is looking great, but I can't help but feel as if it's missing something. I know, flower wreaths. Flower wreaths are the final touch or pole needs to celebrate the traditional way. It so happens I have set up a workstation for guests to make their own flower crowns. You could use that to assemble larger wreaths as well. Head on over to the flower crown workstation and make four wreaths for our pole. All right. Well, okay, we take it later. Okay, Dylan, here is the speakers and the food. Banana. Smells so good! I could eat the banquet myself. Okay, okay, I will wait till everyone else has had some first. Wow, impressive! So, now we are ready to pump up the volume. This midsummer party is going to be off the chain. Nice. Ooh, now the music is on. Oh, there we have the workstation. <laughs> Take some time now. Wreath crafting. The ranger have already made sure to supply you with the resources needed to craft four wreaths. Press craft button to begin crafting a wreath. Splendid. Let's place them on the pole. Ooh. Oh, and you're wearing one for a crown. Very beautiful. There's only one thing left to do. It's time to raise the pole. We will do it together on my mark. Three, two. Okay, let's go then. <gasps> wow, so beautiful with so many colors. Wow, that was very, very impressive, I have to say. But it's very tall. I cannot see the top of it. <laughs> Just look at that! The finest midsummer pole in all of Jorvik and a perfect setting for the frog dance. Frog dance? You remember the moves, right? Wow, so we can actually have the frog dance or some sort. <laughs> okay, let's continue. Ashley, are we ready for making a bigger bonfire? That should be enough wood to get us started. I'm pretty sure Kima from Mistful will be bringing more wood later from the trails, she cleared. Okay, this party's about to heat up. Ooh, 
Ooh, now we're talking. But we don't need to run. Time to get this baby boarding. Normally I will insist on lighting it myself for maximum safety. But considering how much you helped, perhaps you did like the honor? Yeah, please. I will be pretty slow and take it easy. Let's fire it. Woo! <laughs> Amazing! Wow, this is so amazing. Ashley, look at it, it's beautiful. Yes, yes, burn, burn, burn. Oh, okay, crazy. <laughs> um, sorry about that. <laughs> Sometimes I get a little carried away. Um, good work with a fire. Very safe. <laughs> you have two personalities, haven't you? Woo, and we leveled up to level eight. Amazing! And with level 9, we have more opportunities to buy clothes. Because most of it, for, for some reason, has been to level 9 or something. So. Okay, Dylan, you're the last one we need to help. My favorite thing about Midsummer Parties growing up was the way they brought the whole community together. That's why this year we are inviting people you might have met from all around Yorick to share in the festivities. Who knows, you might even see some new faces as well. I prepared the invitations while you were setting up the banquet. Now we just need to drop them in the mailbox. Will you mind dropping them off for me? Drop the invitation in the red mailbox near Midsummer Festival. Okay, Ooh, there we have a red, red, <laughs> a red mailbox. Invitations are sent. So, Tables uh, and chairs, check. Food, check. <laughs> check. Everything's covered on my end. Thanks for your help, Stella. <gasps> looks it. Look see, <laughs> it looks so nice and the pole is so beautiful with all the colors. Oh, and the fire is so big and the tables here. Oh gosh, this midsummer is so beautiful. But as I can see, we have used a lot of time on helping out on or with the midsummer festival. So we need to continue the quest in Marisol here. Next time, I really want to continue this midsummer festival because it will not be here for a long time. And I really want to get finished with it and celebrate everything and have so much fun with this beautiful festival. So that was all we have time for in this episode. What do you guys think about the midsummer festival? I really love all the decorations and this flower pole here is super super nice and beautiful with all the colors and the bonfire is very dramatic and nice and the tables the whole place here is so beautiful so what is your favorite thing or favorite activity on this midsummer festival place i have not tested out anything of these yet but i think we'll get to that when we are back and gonna help marisol out or help her with more stuff here on a festival or midsummer festival site so yeah there will be more uh, things to come and my definitely favorite here right now is that flower poll so give it a thumbs up if you like the video don't forget to subscribe share it with your friends and i see you in the next episode bye